Hey, hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf Your One Million. Well, how are all my adventurers doing? Yes, I'm playing Genshin Impact like pretty much everybody else. It's been actually a lot better than I thought. At first, when I actually started this game, I thought I wasn't going to actually enjoy it or anything. Um, I might in the next few days be uploading my whole adventure that I've had on stream. I don't know if it's going to be uncut or am I going to, you know, edit it mostly, mostly the story into it. It really depends. I'm not going to be making guides on it, really. Uh, eh, I might make one or two on, like, bosses or something. But, yeah, I've explored the whole map. I mean, it's only been, like, 16 hours of gameplay. <laughs> Is what I want to say. No, no, probably, like, nah, probably 16 hours of gameplay. Because <laughs> I played for eight hours the first day it was released. And I explored, like, pretty much all of this area. And funny enough, my first boss ever was this fucking flower over here. I made a mistake. I was doing this for a quest and somehow I ended up here. <laughs> but I'll, I'll show that one like later on my first encounter with it. But if you guys want a video on, like, on all of that, you guys can feel free to leave a like on the video. And they'll let me know that you guys want more videos from me but first things first my account <laughs> so free you get her for free she's level 40 right now i recently just got into uh phase twos so i still gotta get all these up i know where I these are when I'll be as tall as i say these sister. were in nah oh yeah actually yeah it was i think i mostly found those in like spring springville level 41 actually Ning is definitely my highest damage dealer, that's for sure. Like, DPS-wise, like, 101, she's the highest damage dealer. I actually have this weapon on her. I wish I could refine it if I can get another copy. I definitely am. Because this actually brings out a lot of damage. I also need to find that soon. Artifacts, mostly going with attack and charge attack since... She also has a talent that I just recently opened that all her charge attacks no longer consumes her stamina. Also need to get over here too, but that's phase four, which is going to be a while. I also got Razor. Razor's actually been like really amazing. Like it's <laughs> baffling really of how good he is. So he's my main um, electric unit, main water, main geo, main electro. Chrono is, I can't even, Chong, 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 however you pronounce his name, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> but he has a sick design, that's one of the reasons why I like them. Not only that, his AoE works for everybody, it just enhances your weapon, which is extremely good. And then there's my main character for Wind, I, I don't have any other Wind units. <laughs> Main fire. And then we have the rest of the unmentions. <laughs> I'll say free characters, really. Technically free. Guaranteed. Then we have Amber. Then we have Fischl. Who I plan on getting up. I plan on using Fischl for um, Storm Terror, really. Huh, okay. So that should be fun. <sighs> so, progress has been going great. I'm level 25. I recently got there like last night. I've really done too much co-op because I'm kind of confused how co-op works. I'm not sure if like if the party leader consumes the stamina because that would actually be great because if only the party leader, leader consumes stamina, that would be amazing just because we will have lots more time to just help others too but if it consumes stamina for the whole party that then it's kind of like meh what's the point of doing co-op <laughs> i could when most of the time it seems like co-op is just really in game because everything else is just really easy especially as you're leveling up like i'm just unsure about that right now even i also got some events going on I, it's day five already jeez Day five. Hello, nice to meet 
Uh, Venti is actually a lot better than I thought he was. To be honest, I told people I did not like Venti. <laughs> but guess what? We're going to be summoning for him. Why not? Why not? So, <sighs> let, let's get into it. All right, so Finty's up first. The main character I'm trying to get right now is Jean. Jean is my favorite design in this game. So, yeah, my my luck has not been going well. <laughs> Let's just say that. I mean, after this, I'm not going to be doing any more summons at all. It's literally just going to be saving up for Nair and waiting for the next banner. Because we got like 14 days, basically. Wait, which one is it? Okay, here we go. Uh, let's grab these first. Alright, those achieved. Might have enough to get that one too. Might. Alright. Let's go. Let's see what we get. I've never gotten a yellow out of this, just so you guys can know. <laughs> Oh, okay. I like dupes. Hey, sometimes a freaking four star can outclass a five star, really. Alright, let's go. But I say this has always been my summons. It, it will always be one purple and all blues. That's all my summons I ever, ever had on this game since starting. Oh, we got two dupes. Hold up a second. Oh, well, we guess we're bringing up our healer. <laughs> This is actually pretty good just for dupes too, for these characters, just because these are actual characters I plan on using a lot of. Okay. Okay, so we got a spear, let's see. Okay, power damage. Stuff like that. Nothing we really care about. Hey! <gasps> Fucking Jean! You know what? Fuck it. I don't I don't need to summon any more. I got Jean. Yes! <laughs> ah, this was worth it. This was so worth it. Oh, this was so worth it. My main is here and I'm happy. Oh, thank God. Well then. <laughs> That's fantastic. Now I'll just keep summoning on this then. There's no reason to go to the other one. People said they have more luck skipping than they have just straight up summoning. Like watching the summon. That's that's the worst part. <laughs> that's actually hilarious. What's this? This one is also pyro and electric. Well, I know who I'm gonna be working on all day. Oh, wait, hold up. We can go uh actually we can do off the main banner too. Oh my god, I'm so happy. I don't have anything to up her though. Now I gotta figure out how I wanna build her. Hold up, what are what are her skills? Pull and surround the enemies. Ooh. Okay, so she's more of a healer. 
Oh, first off, I need to up you guys with your constellations. This is going to help us out big time. Even more heals off this, too. Because I carry her pretty often. That's why I say the character banner instead of the standard banner is always going to be better. Just because you'll get more dupe hits for four stars that you're actually going to use. Instead of the standard. Don't don't use don't summon on the standard. I would recommend summoning on Venti's banner. Even if you don't want Venti, I would re still recommend summoning on those canner on those banners just because those four stars are still pretty good. Ah, uh, Okay. I wanna see how she looks in my party. Uh, we're gonna place you. Ready for anything. Ah, perfect. Oh, okay, I like her fighting style. Huh, interesting. I'll say, when you look at it, it looks like a little boss. <laughs> oh yeah, I've basically beat every character, well, every boss in the game. So I don't have to worry about like that anymore. I was about to say, it, it took a while. I ran into some really annoying stuff. I think the first really annoying like thing I ran into and was able to beat. Yeah, you know, the first actual like annoying boss I ever was able to beat was the um, wind cube. The electric cube was easy. The geo cube was pretty easy too. I just want to see what this skill does, buddy. Like, calm down. Wait, did you fall in the water? Okay, I was about to say. Because normally it's a one-shot death for you guys if you fall in the water. I mean, this is good for pushing people off the map, actually. So I welcome it. Because enemies in the uh, tower are pretty much going to hate me. Especially when it comes to, like, pushing them off. Okay, there we go. Oh, okay, this is like a AoE heal. I like it. That's actually pretty dope. Okay. <laughs> Not playing around with him. <laughs> but Jean is definitely... I'm going to give her... Well, actually, we have a lot of swords now. Huh. I say I do like carrying that sword, but I actually might max out one of these other swords. But I do like using this too. I say this sword's pretty cool. Oh, okay. It's basically like my um. Uh, my stuff that I'm using. I still have no five-star weapons, too. Maybe we'll get in the future. Uh, how am I going to build Jean? I kind of want to build her uh, energy, for one. And... Do I have any more alarm clocks? No, I do not. I wonder if I can find one here. Any energies? I might push heal receive in too along with HP increase nah uh, I think I, I I know what I'm gonna do now let's take that defense we're gonna make her more support for everyone he'll receive is definitely gonna be a thing and maybe we'll but nah maybe I should go all the way into this first. Oh, for every character that uses a bow, though. Hmm. 
Hmm. I mean, that's not half bad. Not, I'm not saying that's a bad thing. But there's better. <laughs> that, that's all I'm saying. Is there that there's better? Okay, so now I have to start uh, dungeon farming too. Okay, so this is the exile. Okay, ah, uh, okay, I'm gonna build exile actually, then build this one too. Okay, so that one's on there. Uh, I don't know if I have exile actually. Hold up a second. No, oh, I do. Surprisingly. Okay, we need Scholar for... Who am I going to take out? We're going to change this one. Oh, no. Okay, yeah. I forgot. We can't actually have that. Because one of them is going to be useless. Uh, we're going to change this one to something else. HP... Attack percentage. That's what we need. We're going to change that one to attack percentage, and we're going to change this useless one to an attack. Or energy recharge, actually. That could actually be good, pretty good, too. But then again, I'm leaning towards more attack. <laughs> think mastery or HP mastery yeah okay yeah we're gonna go with that one but yeah I got, I got tons of progress done I'm gonna be uploading all of those little uh, series but I say if you guys are looking forward to more content from me then feel free to leave a like I, I definitely have a lot of ideas I want to try with this game for sure and they're interesting at one and some of them I'm still puzzled about doing just because I have a lot of searching to do I have a lot of cooking to do on this too <laughs> uh, first things first I need to start finishing some weapons here but I'll say this is what I always do is just keep reforming all my weapons If you got duplicates, reform. At least get one of them for each. Just because some of these like, bows become like really powerful on Reform 5. Reform 5 is the maximum. Rank 5 is the maximum for any weapon in the game. So, yeah. Hold on. Do I have another one? Oops. I think I have another one. Oh, yeah. We definitely summoned for another one. <laughs> I mean, you can make as many as you want, really, but, I mean, I would just say, I would recommend, actually, people just use um, three stars, really, if you have the duplicates for it. I'd say, really, five stars are decent and all. It really depends on the skill that you're getting from it. If the skill is, like, really good, but it relies on, like, a lot of um, chance, and that chance increases... I would say if it's not as good as a three that you want to use, then I would recommend using the three. Oh, actually, this one's... Is that one? Okay, no, this one's Hydro. I wish we could lock them or favorite them so I won't end up, like, you know, putting them inside of my auto... My auto enhance. That's one thing the devs need to add is a favorite. Favorite is one thing that we need. Um, 
I say sprinting consumption with characters that reduce sprint also needs to be looked into. Well, not reduce sprint, reduce the cost of stamina. Because that doesn't look like it's making a difference at all, really. In my in my personal opinion, I I've looked at it and it I just feel like it does not work at all. <laughs> but I I could be wrong. Who knows? <laughs> I mean, this is just going off of what I've been witnessing, really. But the thing I want to talk about is that there are a few things that need to be fixed inside of this game. One is the way multiplayer works. Multiplayer literally having like this really stupid thing to where only the host actually gets the rewards. Anybody who's helping doesn't get jack shit apparently. Which makes absolutely no sense. At that point it's basically pointless for multiplayer to even exist in this game really. Which is really sad to be honest. Because I was actually looking forward to co-op. And all this was told to me by my sister, too. She said, literally, just, that's all, bro. <laughs> you get nothing else out of it. Which is just, like, really flawed at that. I'm sad about that, dude. Like, why would you make it that way? But the thing I want to see is... I guess they're trying not to, like, ration... <sighs> Since people were telling me the world does not replenish. I guess that's one way to keep people from, like, I guess going to other people's world and stealing stuff. I would say the world should just replenish. That would, that would make no sense to have the world not replenish, really. I don't know. A lot of things are just very flawed in this game even though I do enjoy it I I can admit that a lot of things need to be changed I mean one everybody's asking for the option to pet animals which their cats inside of Lingwei and the dogs inside of Mondstadt and Lingwei you know <laughs> which is no quite a priority yeah <laughs> Like, you're going to make a game without me being able to pet animals? The fuck, dude? <laughs> but yeah, multiplayer is lackluster. A lot of people have already expressed that. And to be honest, a lot of people don't even do multiplayer or co-op. They mostly go through the game themselves. Or either they do, like, some type of stupid thing to where it shouldn't even be a thing. Or have to be a thing to where... It's like, you help me in my dungeon, and I help you in mine. Well, I'm not really sure if dungeons actually, uh... Oh, God. I was say, actually not sure if dungeons work that way. She just told me in general that chests are only for the host. I, I guess dungeons will work differently, considering it's a dungeon. But I haven't tried it out yet. The first time I tried it, everybody else in the party was confused of how to start it. <laughs> Ow. I'm actually just doing these just to get some XP. I actually have not used this much resin at all. <laughs> this is my first time actually using all of this. Okay, so now I need to go get more dandelions, which are... Pretty much all of, around Mondstadt, really. Then I gotta go get these. These are easy to get. It's just the dandelion seeds that are gonna be the issue. But to be honest, that's really the only complaint I have is multiplayer not being, you know, as good as we thought it would be. Ooh, a lot of resources. And. If it's true the world doesn't replenish stuff, then yeah, that's another big factor that needs to be looked into. Just because it. Resources, dude. <laughs> I was like, well, what else do I have to explain? Resources to up characters. Like, that, that's an issue. But if anybody has any more details for me in explaining, like, the situation on, like, replenishing. Or 
multiplayer in dungeons? Because all I've heard is mostly like outside of dungeons. Like it's it's kind of in a weird state right now. I need I need more information. Ah oh, damn! At least that put him in the circle though. <laughs> If I was to be honest with you, I don't really know about the replenishing part of the world. I think some things replenish as of dailies. I know shops don't replenish. Well, most shops don't replenish. And it doesn't say if they replenish like every week or so. Yeah. From what I've seen, they don't replenish. Because I bought those like at the start of the game and it's been like five days. So if that does replenish, it's every week. Which is understandable, if that was the case. Funny enough, I bought all this from another shop, too. I bought, like, every single last one of these. So that's why, if you see, I have a hundred of them. I only buy the ones that say sold at grocery stores. I don't really buy the ones that say that they're found in the wild. Because you'll find a lot of them. Huh. Got no bonuses for this. Uh, I need two more of these, actually. But yeah, that, that's the only thing I really can't vouch for. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure... Wait, am I looking at the wrong one? It said four. Okay, yeah, this, this is the one. This one... That confused me for a second. No, this is Cryo. Oh, okay, so I am looking at the wrong one. On the shot. Well, on the combine. So I would have been combining Cryo, then Jewish just would have been puzzled. <laughs> but I've been making a lot of progress. Like, pretty decently fast. Nothing like off the charts amazing. Uh, I'm gonna have to look for a lot of dandelions, though. A lot of freaking dandelions. Thank God I farmed that twice. So now I have healing bonus. So I can only do one for that. How much would this take altogether? Okay, so that'll give me the 45 if I get that much. And that'll be like two runs of the Geo Clouds. Geo Lines. Uh, hmm. Think about changing this weapon to a three for sure. I think this would probably be it, really. Just because my attack speed being increased, which means more healing for my teammates. Well, not attack speed, movement speed, actually. Eh. I guess it really doesn't matter. I guess this would be better than anything. Or this, really. Just because that would be off of my uh, basics and my... And it would just be like a more overall healing. It's really questionable. I might go this, really. I'm still looking for like a good sword that I can... That I really want. And then I want to go over here, look at what weapons I can craft. Because their prototype is decent. Huh. Maybe I will get this. I just need a little bit more of these and I gotta go farm that from a... Uh, Storm Terra. <laughs> I might be a support dude, but I'm a good support. Fuck you guys. <sighs> Wait, hold up. How much? How much more do I have to go look for afterwards? I gotta look for 20? Jeez. Oh, I really hope these resources replenish now. Because <laughs> I, I haven't farmed dandelions since I started. I think they come back with, like, dailies. I think 
Maybe the world does replenish. It's just that some resources take longer than others to replenish. Which would make sense. Huh. I don't know. I, I say give it a few more days before I actually get evidence of that. I'll say maybe somebody else will, like I said, let me know. Because, like I said, I need more information than off these things than what other people are giving me. So, if anybody has any more info, just feel free to leave it down in the comments. <sighs> but, with all that said, guys, I'm going to be ending off here. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys on the next one. Until then, you guys have a lovely day. Peace out.